In the bottom left playing Sedge this time with cleaner codes for switching to his opponent's previous commander. Now Trillian is playing twins who are not Greenfinger, but they are a medium charge character. So we'll see how this goes. See if there's any big differences being right out here. Interestingly, Trillian is now no longer sending the sword for the early capture on this village. I wonder if that's gonna make much of a difference here. In a code, healing his commander up very early. Actually, both of them are really. So. Edge, of course, is going to have a little bit more money to do that, so. We'll see how this plays out. Yeah, the timing on this village capture means the mage will just be able to decap it straight away. And then kind of threaten position to do more damage later. Ooh, twins were really in range of Sedge there. Sedge gets a free hit on the, the twins. <laughs> oh, the mage is just ignoring the village. He's going to go for that sword. I mean, it makes sense because now if he tries to capture this... Tower, for example, it's like the tower can go down to the mage as well. So, yeah, Trillian's realized, oh, I'm getting bullied. So I better recuperate and uh, gather my army together. Heals come down on both sides. That's small heal on the mage. Clean code realizing that overextending just to kill a sword is not worthwhile, especially when there's a knight. Easily kill the mage. Ooh, I like this play. Knight's gonna be able to go around. Damage. Ooh. That is a lot of fighting going on here, but Clean Echo is just gonna be able to run back. And losing units to deal damage to your opponent's commander, like Sedge is way ahead on Groove Charge, even though he's the slower of the commanders here. Yeah, he can just walk back and heal. I think like even just pulling back his army, he could have just left his sword there to kill that sword, but fights against it. And now, really, and actually setting up a decent formation here. I do think it can get punished though. It's a little worrying, but got a lot of nice stuff going on behind it. I like the archers. They're going to be able to cover if Cleaner Code goes in too deep. But I don't think Cleaner Code will. I think he's just going to be fairly careful. That sets up a really nice formation here. It's very night proof. And he's just going to get stray hits where he can. He's in a really good position. He doesn't need to push or throw anything away. And the question is, can Trillian make something happen here? Can he push in a way that will allow him to get an advantage or to threaten the stronghold dragon guarding it so that's gonna be really tough to do basically has to actually not quite abandon this front but he's definitely like leaving this front alone Ooh, big hit on the mage that's gonna be huge because now this dragon can just walk in and do damage almost completely free Sedge has groove Although he's only got it a little bit ahead of Twins, but that said, I think Sedge Groove is much better than the Twins Groove. Lunar Code's just being very aggressive this turn. Ooh, that's a good kill in the night. And that Mage Crit is going to be pretty big with an Archer Crit. I think the Archer Crit should have come down first, but... Actually, I think, yeah, the archer crit and the archer hit should have come down first because the mage would have been able to possibly live. Although that said, actually, that's probably a bad thing because Sedge would have been able to groove off the mage. Sacrificing the mage? Not not too bad. All right, what's cleaner code going to do here? Ooh, I like this. This is a nice position. The thief. Oh, but cleaner code. He's got so much stuff here. 
Actually, the dra if the dragon had flown back, he could have been part of that mage shield too. Oh, but let's go deal with the wagon instead. Alright, and this thief's gonna go down. The Trillion going for like a kind of aggressive play, but not quite paying off. I actually think if he'd had a more guarded position and had thrown fire down first, that would have been a nice way to like get a big gold lead. Alright, we got fire coming out. I mean, he kind of has to because, you know, air units are going to start coming out of this tower pretty soon. As long as he keeps this balloon here, then he's fine. Nothing can get built out of that tower. The fire might backfire though because it's also going to leave one side open to a night crit in a little bit. And cleaner code having pretty much completely dealt with like this bottom side is going to be able to just push up and he's going to have a huge economic lead he's got all these corner villages and that's a ton of money to have Ooh, but we're gonna see oh right so i guess just archers and i think Trillian realizes that he's so far behind. Can't really do anything. And honestly, as long as like this knight goes down. Good, although I actually know the dragon will just kill at this point. Yep. Well played, the cleaner code. Actually really expertly played that game. Defended where he needed to. Didn't kind of leave himself too open. Put lots of pressure on where he needed to. And uh, managed to build Groove before his opponent. Despite being a, a slower charge rate. So, yeah. Nice to play the cleaner code. Trillion showing some good plays. But just some things to work on in future, I think.